Despite the National Hajj Commission of Nigeria's extension of the deadline to January 31st for the 2024 Hajj pilgrimage, the number of intending, intending pilgrims is yet to reach the allocated 90,000 seats for Nigeria. In the unfolding narrative of the 2024 Hajj, a notable challenge emerges, which is the persistent low turnout even with the extension. As pilgrims from various regions were given extra time to register, the hope was to facilitate a broader participation. However, the turnout remains sluggish, with reports attributing this to the associated cost. In response, Hajj operators are implementing installment payment plans to address the concern. For the intending programs, we should look beyond the worldly games. One. If you consider you paying 4.5 million, imagine, and that is not the final payment, you know, probably uh, shortly after uh, the uh, uh, Saudi, I mean, Saudi authority releases its uh, components of, for the Hajj payment. You see, Hajj authority might say, okay, you, they need to top in some, some certain amount. And good side of it is that, for the states, they have this advantage of BT at the end of the day, meaning the old money being paid is not going to uh, go for the Hajj activities alone. Some uh, they are they, some some amount of money will be given back to them. So, but what is there is that I want to appeal if probably the authority, that's the National Hajj of, uh, uh, Commission, can just try to give a, another room, maybe an extension for those who are still trying to catch up so that they too, they will not be left out of these uh, 2024 Hajj uh, rights. Okay.